You can actually change your brain. Research suggests that people with Parkinson's who exercise strenuously, start early, keep it up, can build new pathways in their brain. So go neurons, go! Go neurons, go neurons, activate! Yo homie, listen up. All the parkies in the room, put your hands up. All the parkies in the room, put your hands up. When I say, say what, say what, you say kick Parkinson's butt. Say what, say what, kick, kick Parkinson's, Parkinson's butt. butt. Say what, say what, kick, kick Parkinson's butt. butt. My name is Sharon Kai, and they all knew me. I used to be the spokesman for the university. But you know you have a problem when your steps get small and you act a little wimpy with the tendency to fall. Hold it. But then I had an insight. What a revelation. You can change your brain and see a transformation. Go, neurons, go, neurons, activate. Becky Farley has a theory that we start by moving big. That's about as likely as a flying pig. Because we're parkies. We're stubborn. We like tentative and small. We festinate, procrastinate, and barely move at all. Go, neurons, go, neurons, activate! It's not the muscle that's the problem. It's the message from your brain. And it takes a mighty effort if you want to retrain. Push yourself beyond your boundaries. Make it very tough. If it doesn't feel too hard to do, it's not hard enough. All that effort builds new pathways in the back roads of your brain, makes those neurons fat and happy, makes them lively once again. Go neurons, go neurons, activate! Take big steps, don't be squeamish. Spread your fingers wide and strong. Make those gestures bold and forceful as you quickly stride along. A little pain, a lot of gain. Say what?